you already kind of just gave it to us, but our hors d'oeuvre segment is the sex tips, and we love to leave it to the guests. Do you have any one blanket tip that maybe works for everybody? Is it men for women, women for men? I think, um, so one of the things is I say you can't, whenever a relationship doesn't work, it's, <laughs> and I get in trouble for this a lot of times, because it's always the man's fault. And I'll, t- I'll tell you why, because it's, um, if you have a woman that's too strong, you can't tell a woman yeah, I mean, and all of y'all have done this. Oh, girl, he's nice. Give him a chance. What you're really saying is he's not strong enough to handle you. So be weaker so that you can give him an, an opportunity. And you can't do that. That that alleviates the, the attraction. The attraction is the fact that he is stronger. Like a woman only finds a man attractive who she thinks is better than her. And better is a is a relative term. I'll agree with that. It's a, He's too nice or give him a chance. Right. But what if it's because someone is being good to us and we're not used to that? It's still it, his inability to recognize that he's being too nice is is his deficiency. OK, I guess. So it, it, even the fact that he's he's deficient in his ability to perceive what's going on. And so you like I say, if, if you want to be a man, there's no vacation days in manhood. You got to show up every day. This is a toxic episode. Mm. You, you this don't. Is, this is interesting because I, I agree I, and don't agree. So I but I also just kind of had this conversation mm. last night as well, like to the fact that when you date someone um, you need to allow them to show you who they are. Yeah. Um, and I, my it's relationship's crazy. You, you, gotta, yeah. you also have to look at, so when you're a child <laughs> and your mom is around, that is the true depiction of what you see womanhood as. I mean, th- if you think about how many people you know that are just garbage, they're garbage because, because people, of their upbringing. people, you know, you have children and you, you, yeah. you, you're not raising them how you want them to be as adults. You're raising them just as it happened. My know, mom this tells is- me all the time that she's like, I couldn't have had another one. She's like, I felt like there was a lot of energy and a lot of things I wanted to teach you. And she was like, and I couldn't balance myself. Like, I think one was it. Like, she always says that. She's like, I don't think another one could have came out. And I, I think also it's a situation where you, you know, it's it's sort of like buying a new laptop and then you back up the laptop from your old your your old um Computer? your old backup you okay. know what I mean like you 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 forgot all the shit no I'm saying like you have viruses and malware right and then you you just download all your shit into this Back brand new laptop new and then you Dante, wonder why do you like love analogies so much he loves it he it's loves easy it. to, he it's loves easy. It. you man school two o two better hear what I've got to say because you won't get it again I'm not an alpha male I'm not a beta male either I'm just a better man better man Put your happiness first, because if you don't, they won't.